I'm bringing another video f here for you guys. This is PJ's Fish Tanks. And uh, go ahead and jump into the nano project I got going on. This is a 15 gallon aquarium. Um, no, it is not a 10. As you can see, it's quite a bit wider than 10 and quite a bit longer than a 10 but it is not as high as a 20 but it is higher by a smidge than a 10 um, I did calculate it out measure it calculate it out um, and in fact it is a 15 gallon um, so what I got is I got 40 pounds of live rock that's already been cycled so everything in here I could just add a fish and be good um, obviously the water is low I didn't get a chance to fill it up the rest of the way um, so yeah I'll have another video when it's, once it is full um, but anyway I'm going with a bare bottom there is some sand basically just because of it all coming off the rocks as I'm moving in, water, blah blah blah. Um, so for water movement I got a little power head there and I got my old, old protein skimmer. Now I'm not going to use it to do any kind of skimming just because it is a hassle to get working right. Once you get it working right the next day it won't work right again so it's basically just for water movement I mean I could probably put um, probably put some carbon in there if I wanted to and whatnot uh, I got my old 100 watt heater still kicking works fantastic I know the water is low, but um, it still works. I mean, it's no different than you doing water changes and the water getting low. Um, and I see 24 inch light. I probably said that already. So that is going to be my 15 gallon nano salt water. Um, I forgot to also mention I'm going to do this as a bio load tank only for filtration um, I'm probably not going to use any carbon um, I know fresh water is a little different than salt water but in my my fresh water tank I have no carbon whatsoever it's all biological filter um, and it's been going for months and months and my fish are healthy and they're growing like crazy. I will actually have a video up shortly. Um, hopefully within a day or two of that. Um, showing how much it's grown and whatnot. Uh, excuse me. Um, so yeah, that's what I got. I'm probably only going to do two fish in this. Um, I already have a fish for it. I just, you know, I wanted to wait to let it settle and you know with the protein skimmer sitting for a while there's stuff that built up I want to let it all get out and clean it up just so it's a little cleaner for the fish when I get it all ready even though I could put a fish in there if I want to right now um, I'm just waiting um, I want to do a good clean out get all the stuff out there's you know some hairs for my girlfriend in there and um, for moving around and get all me blah 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 Anyway, so yeah, this is my budget nano, like I said before. Uh, cost me nothing. I had everything laying around. Um, obviously, it cost me something at one point, but as the build right now, I have no money going into it. And the only real money I'm going to have is when I go for the cleanup crew and the second fish if I add a second fish um, so that'll be the only money I really have tied up into it um, let's go ahead and I'll see how it looks with the lunar light I know 
Uh, some of the rocks had some pretty crazy looking. Wow, does that look cloudy? Okay. Uh, yeah, you ain't gonna see all the all the sponges. Um. Mm, I don't know if you can see some of it. No, it's it's yeah, I'm not gonna see it. Can't see it. Oh, okay, but yeah, most of that red stuff right there is all sponge. Um. All right, so that's about it, guys. If you have any questions on my build, um, obviously I'll have videos up of it, completely filled, fishing, all that stuff shortly um but in the meantime if you have any questions <clears throat> on anything uh feel free to comment below and let me know um i'll gladly answer anything you need to know or what you ask um so yeah all right you guys uh have a good one